All right, what's up, YouTube, man? I'm back with another one. I actually started recording this on my third stop, so I should have started recording this for my first stop. Today's shift, man, I, uh, I got my route is about 280 miles today, which is cool. I had six, I got six stops to do. I'm on my third one right now. Um, so, you know, this video today just going to be a quick rundown of my route for the day, uh, what it's looking like so far. So, uh, I started my route in Baltimore. I picked up an empty from there. I do, and then what I'm going to do, man, I'm going to put up, I'm going to take a screenshot of my route and I'm going to insert it in here too, uh, cause I'm going off the top right now. So picked up an empty in Baltimore. Then I had to drive somewhere called, uh, something Maryland, like Bartsville, Maryland. I, I never heard of it. And I'm from Baltimore. So that's what I'm saying. Maryland, there's so many parts of Maryland. Um, and I had to go there. And I had to pick up a little drop off an empty, pick up a little, and then um from there I just drove, I just got to New Jersey. I'm um dropping off that little. Now what they doing though, this is this is uh, something new for me. Like I said, I learn something every day. Right now, I'm at a third party stop. So this is my first time like at a third party stop. Basically, so it's not like uh, Amazon. Working for Amazon. You mainly just go to Amazon warehouses and everything, everything Amazon. But sometimes you do go to a third party. This third party I'm at, I was like, you know, I went in to check in and everything. I'm like, hey, you know, I'm dropping off a load and I'm picking up an empty. Because that's mainly what you do in Amazon. When you go to these Amazon spots, you drop off a load, pick up an empty. Drop off a load, you might pick up another load. So that's a different trailer. Man, they told me like... No, you got a live unload. I'm like, a live unload? I'm like, what's that? So basically what they're doing is, man, right now, instead of me just dropping this trailer and then go ahead and pick up an empty, I have to actually sit and wait while they unload this trailer. Um, And then once they finish unloading it, I'm going to take this as an empty trailer. So this was my first time doing that. Um. So, you know, that's interesting, but it's cool, man. Like I said, I'm out here in New Jersey. It's my third stop. I still got three more stops to go. From here, I got to go to another place in New Jersey. Then back to Baltimore. I got like two more stops in Baltimore. Then I'm done for the day. Um, I did start my shift at 2 a.m. Yep, I started at 2 a.m. today. Um, and I'm, I'm not scheduled to get off until 4 p.m. So I came in at 2 a.m. Uh, today is Tuesday and I'm supposed to get off at 4 p.m. So yeah, you know, I'm gonna just record a couple videos, man. Take y'all through my route for the day. And I'm gonna try to just do this on a, you know, on a weekly, daily type of thing. So y'all can get a idea what I'll be doing, man. So just stay tuned. We lit, man. Make sure y'all like, comment, and subscribe. Show me love, man. Any questions, any new drivers, any comments, any advice, man, reach out to me. Let me know. We're going we to talk about it. Let's get it. So, yeah, show you all where I'm at now, man. The living refrigerators. So, I'm about to dock on this door. What a night. All right, y'all. I'm trying to back up, and um, I'm at the third party spot now. And uh, I'm trying to. Their dock doors is a board. Different than the Amazon, they told me to move it over some, try to stay between the lines. So, you know. Unfortunately, it's another bad thing. It's like it's dark time, so I can I can barely see. It, but definitely doing what I'm doing. Definitely doing what I gotta do. All right, so I'm gonna keep going back until I hit that dock door. I should feel a bump. They want me to get up on it tight, so. Hopefully it don't knock the phone off. Oh, you heard that? You heard that and felt that. Bump the dock. So we're gonna get out, I'm gonna make sure it, look, it looks fine and everything. I had to get stay in between these lines. It's good. All right, cool. Just All right, yeah, man. Um, sorry about that, y'all. So yeah, as you can see, I docked, stayed in the lines. Um, the gentleman just was talking to me. Stuff. We good to go. Hey, 
what's up, y'all? We still waiting, man. While I'm waiting for them to finish unloading, I also wanted to um go into something else, man. When I just was at my last stop, bro, I had to slide my tandems back. So it was my first time having to slide to my tandems. I've been working for the company for six months now. And I haven't never had to slide my tandems back. So I went by me going to a third party instead of an Amazon warehouse. They made me slide my tandems back to the rear. I think for like stability, when you, um, you know, when you got these heavy loads, they want, they like to have your, your tires to the rear, man. So, hey, YouTube, YouTube is my best friend. I didn't buckle under pressure. I was about to get stressed out at first, man. I just pulled my phone out got on YouTube and I typed in how to slide your tandems and I literally just did it. It took me like quick five minutes to watch the video, got out, I uh, pulled the lever, hopped in, pushed my uh, yellow brake valve in, uh, went to drive and I pulled forward and I was good. It slid, I slid it all, my tires all the way to the rear. So I think I'm gonna do a vid, I'm gonna definitely do a video like actually showing how to, um, um slide your tandems to the rear so that was interesting for me y'all that was that was definitely interesting for me um like i said man that's what i'm saying like driving trucks you gonna learn something new like if it's not every day like every couple weeks every couple months like i'm only six months in and i'm rare i feel like i'm comfortable now like i learned a lot um but i still feel like it's, it's still situations that have come up like today so so far on my route today that's two things that's that was new for me that's the sliding my tandems back and then the live unload i never did that before so i never slid my tandems back and i never had to sit for a live unload this is my first time um so yeah i just wanted to tap back in with y'all while we waiting um i'm making sure my hours of service good and everything i'm on taking my 30 minutes break so you definitely got to do your 30 minute break i don't know if y'all could really see that though Definitely gotta do your 30 minute break. So I'm gonna tap back in with y'all, man. What's up, y'all? I just wanna show y'all that um people starting to show up and everything. Um it's currently sick. The time is one second. 618. 618 a.m. and I'm still waiting for my um live unload. So what's up you two man? I'm still waiting for them to unload. While I'm waiting, man, I am actually getting a little tired. I figured why not take a quick nap really quick. So I just want to show y'all, man. Brought my pillow. And I also, I ordered this off of Amazon, man. It's like real, it's like a, uh, it's supposed to be like you can sit on, but I use it for my back, man. I use, put that up with the pillow. Cause if you don't know, I, I am in a day cab. So I'll show you. I'm in a day cab. I'm not in no sleeper. So that means, you know, I don't have nowhere to go to sleep. So when I'm waiting on the load, that's what I do, pop up, kick back, and I go to sleep. So hopefully that don't take too much longer. Hey. All right, what's going on, y'all, man? So um, I was able to make it to my next stop. I'm currently in Trenton, New Jersey. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and end the video here just because, bro, like I said, this was kind of some, like, in the moment stuff. I just randomly decided to start recording, you know, talk to y'all a little bit about my route today. Um, this like my first video for this channel. So this was like, just, you know, this was random. Um, I don't want to keep, you know, just make this video so long, just talking and stuff. So I was like, I'm gonna go ahead in the head. I do got two more stops, but this shouldn't be nothing crazy. I should, I'm in Trenton, New Jersey. I'm about to pick up uh, a load. Once I pick up this load, I'm gonna drive back to Baltimore, drop off that load, pick up an empty, and then I'm dropping that empty off like around the corner from there and then I'm done for the day. So I was like, you know, I could end the video here. I don't want it to be long and boring and drawn out. Um, This was just like random, my first video. Moving forward, man, I'm deaf. I def, y'all let me know if I do get some viewers on here, man. Let me know if y'all want videos like this where I'm just, you know, doing a quick little rundown of my route. Let y'all know if I run into any issues or anything and you know, you know, and just explain what it is as a new CDL driver. Um, you know, moving forward, man, my video, I'm definitely want to be wanting them to be organized. I probably, uh, I have like a printout of my route or, you know, like something where I can bulletproof, bullet point exactly what I want to go over. 
I could bullet point exactly what I want to go over, you know, be more organized. I can have something in front of me with my route. All of this was like freestyling off the top of my head because um, I can't record and look at my route. So I'm trying to freestyle where I'm going. And, um, you know, that's just what it is, man. This route was cool. 200, uh, I'm driving a total of 280 miles, which is, it's good. It's, you know what I mean? Um, 280 miles. Uh, I, I came in at 2 a.m. It's currently 9 a.m. Um, I don't get off until 4 p.m. So I still got a couple more hours to go. And you know, hopefully y'all stay tuned in to me, man. And you know, y'all could grow with me on this journey, man. As a new CDL driver, um, working for Amazon, and hopefully y'all can see me reach the goals that I'm trying to get to. Um, any veteran truck drivers. Please feel free to give input, um, you know, criticism, anything, advice. I'm just a new CDL driver. Like I said, I've only been driving for six months now. So I'm just wanted to record my journey, document my journey, what I go through, get some advice and tips and just, you know, have a conversation and, and learn along the way. Learn, network, you know, I be having time on my hands. So with that being said, I'm gone, man. Like, comment, and subscribe. Please do that for me, man. I gotta run this page up. I gotta get the viewers in, get some subscriptions. Um, this route was cool. 280 miles came in at 2 a.m. I'm getting off at 4 p.m. Um, I had to slide some tandems back for the first time, and I had to get my live. I had to get my um my load was a live unload. That was the first time for me. So yeah, man. Look, I'm gone, man. Y'all stay blessed up. I just warmed me up. My my lunch, some turkey wings. And I'm ready to chill back. My low not my next low not gonna be ready into two more hours. So I'm about to chill. Probably do some more videos, man. So y'all stay blessed. I'm gone, man.